A risk matrix is a valuable tool in risk management that helps assess and manage risks. It effectively identifies and measures the likelihood and potential impact of risks by visually categorizing risks based on their probability and severity. A risk matrix provides a clear understanding of the risks involved. Different versions of risk matrices exist, such as 5x5, 4x4, and 3x3, and choosing the right template can be a subject of debate among professionals. It is important to select a system that suits your team's needs, considering that fewer rows and columns offer less detailed analysis. When conducting a cyber risk assessment, the organization should start by defining and prioritizing its assets before proceeding with the assessment. Various tools can be employed to aid in the process, including a risk assessment risk analysis matrix that quantifies and visualizes data. This matrix combines two parameters, the impact of the risk scenario and the probability of its occurrence to generate a risk score. A risk and control matrix, or RACM, is a valuable tool for ranking risks and implementing controls to mitigate them. It visually represents potential risks and the protective measures taken to reduce them providing an overview of an organization's risk profile. Inherent risks exist inherently in assets, but controls and safeguards can be implemented to lower them, resulting in a new score known as residual risk. The effectiveness of these controls determines the extent to which the impact and probability of risks are reduced, thus influencing the level of residual risk. Advanced approaches may separately attribute effectiveness to impact or probability, leading to more accurate residual risk scores, but this is typically employed in mature security practices. A risk matrix helps prioritize the most severe risks faced by a company, considering that resources are limited and not all risks can be addressed. Categorizing risks using a traffic light color scheme on the matrix allows for easy identification of the most urgent threats, enabling focused attention on them. Ultimately, organizations need to accept a certain level of risk to achieve success. A 4x4 risk matrix has four levels of probability and four levels of severity. For example, a standard 4x4 risk matrix contains the following values. Severity levels. Negligible, marginal, critical, and catastrophic. Probability levels. Improbable, remote, probable, and frequent. By multiplying the risk probability by its severity, you can calculate the level of acceptability of its risk. The 4x4 risk matrix offers more complexity than a 3x3 matrix. Where a 3x3 matrix falls short in offering a complete risk picture, a 4x4 matrix fills in some of the blanks. Some argue that too many risks may land in the medium-level category and may not be treated as seriously even if they still present a risk. To learn more, visit centralized.com.